Hello people, um, my name is Kaz, and this is an episode from Chill Zone. Woo, uh, this is a new series that I like to call Casterpieces. You know why? Because my name is Kaz, and I make masterpieces. So anyway, this is going to be like a drawing tutorial series, totally not satire. And I'm just going to be drawing things, teaching you guys how to draw. So like, you don't have to go to the store, like Barnes & Noble or whatever, buy those shitty art books for like two bucks teach you how to draw a Pikachu or some shit. So, what we're gonna draw for the first, I, I mean I was just talking about Pokemon, so I guess that's I'm gonna draw some Pokemon. You guys must have seen the new Sun and Moon trailer that just came out like, how long ago? I don't give a shit. So they showed off three starters. You got Rowlet, Litten, and Water. So we're gonna draw them because, I mean, it just came out. There's obviously not too many good drawing tutorials out there. Like I said, you can go to the store, buy a drawing tutorial. They're not gonna have these guys, all right? They're not gonna have these guys, but I do. And I care about your well-being, and I care about who you are on the inside. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start with Rowlet because Rowlet's the best one, and the other ones don't matter. But we're still gonna draw them because gotta give some credit to the other guys. They're cool. So, um, first of all, for Rowlet, he's round. So, you're gonna start by drawing a circle. Alright? So, you got that down. It's not too hard. He has wings. And he's a flying type. He's a flying type. So, you're gonna wanna just add some wings. It's not that hard. This one can come out. Because you gotta get some 3D depth in there. You know? Oh, wait. You got a little thing. You wanna close that up. Next on the, uh, agenda here. Um, what should we add? What should we add, guys? Um... What's most prominent? That was a test. The leaf! Duh! He's a grass type. Gotta add the leaf. So the leaf's down. He's officially both types that he is. Add the little dent in there. You see it. He has eyes. All Pokemon have eyes. Some Pokemon have eyes. So we're just gonna draw them in. It, again, it's really not that difficult. I don't know why you guys even came to this video. Fill them in. There's a paint bucket tool here, by the way. That's, um, it's part of MS Paint. I didn't know about it until very recently, so I think that's really useful. Everyone has pupils. I don't know why they decided to make the pupils white. I think that was a very, very silly idea, but it's okay. We're going to forgive them, and we're going to live. It's not that bad. We can do this. We can get through this. This is I'm a professional at what I do. This is my craft. This is your craft. This is our craft together, and we're going to do it. We're going to do it because nobody else can. Now, if you noticed, he has some ruffles. Little ruffles that kind of connect to his wings. So we're just gonna... See? Again, not as bad as it looks. I know it was threatening. And now all the... Look, we're, we're almost there. He has some feet. Add those in. Boom. One down. Something opened. That's gone. And just add the other one. Now he has feet. Now, what could a Pokemon be without the ability to eat? We got that whole Pokemon Ami thing. I'm sure you're going to be able to feed it, like, fucking, I don't know, fruit snacks. We need to give it the ability to eat the fruit snacks. So here's what we're going to do. Give him his little beak. Boom! We're good! Are you jealous? You shouldn't be, because this is all for you. Drag him up here right now. We're going to move on to Litten. Litten is the fire starter of Pokemon Sun and Moon. He looks like every other fire cat in the series. I don't know how many there were. But it doesn't really matter, because this one's supposed to be a badass. So we're going to start with the head. His head is the most prominent part of this picture. So we're going to get on with there. It's in the front layer. And MS Paint doesn't have layers, so you want to start with what's in the front first. Now, he has this weird symbol on his head. It's red, actually. So I'm just going to add that on. So that's in. Good. Yay. His eyes. His eyes are pretty weird, because they take up like half his face. But we can get around that. We could just, just draw them in. Just draw them in. No big deal. I know it looks weird now, but it's going to look pretty good at the end. And boom. Got his little, his, um, I know he has a frowny face. I wonder why. Maybe it's because nobody's drawn him yet. But now somebody has. So we're going to turn that frown upside down. Yay. See that? That's, a, that's called facial expression conversion. That's a special technique. Only the pros can do. I don't know if you should do it. You might want to leave it as a sad face. Because it takes, it takes some practice. It takes some practice. So he has some whiskers. Boom. Boom. Nice. Nice job. Now these, it kind of looks like glasses, but don't be alarmed. It's not. Don't worry. It's just part of his face. 
Now his butt kind of comes off of his face. But that's all part of depth and perception. You can't see the top of his tail in this example image, but we're gonna assume that it looks like this. All right? I think, I think, yeah. I think it should look like that. So now we gotta put his feet in. Done. Litten, you're out of the way. We can move on to the last starter, Water. All right, Water Buddy. Is that his name? I think it's like, I wanna say Pop. Poplio, his name's Poplio. But we're gonna call him Water because nobody cares. So as you can see, you got his nose. We're already done with his nose. That's the most threatening part of this entire image. We're done with it. He's pretty much out of the way at this point. We're gonna get this done. We're gonna do this. It's only gonna take like, how long? Not long. This isn't even gonna take that much time out of your day. So his little feet are out. His feet are done. We're good. He has a stupid little collar, but we can get around that. The collar, look at that. It took me like a second. It could take you a second too if you put some effort in. Now, I don't want you to be threatened. I don't want you to be alarmed, anything like that. I might, it might look professional. I might, I don't know. I don't mean to like intimidate you. You could be a good artist too. You just have to put some time in. I've been doing this for years. It's, it's quite the, uh, it's a grind. It's really a grind, guys. Everything's a grind, that's life. But look at me now, look at me now. Now, the most, I don't know if you guys like saw this coming or what, but um, as soon as I get these little pupils in here, we're gonna move on to the coloring stage. Coloring stage is the best stage because it really lets us get a little creative. Oh my God, holy shit, did not see that one coming. I can honestly say I didn't, where even is it not closed? Oh no, this is dangerous you guys. This, is... oh geez, I don't know where to fill. I don't know what to do. It's not even like, it's not, oh man, this is scaring me. It's all right, we could do it on a different Pokemon. I promise. Everything's gonna be a-okay, man. Everything's gonna be a-okay. So if something like that happens to you, just cover it up again and you're good, you're safe. See, it wasn't that bad. I got scared, I felt a little not okay. Oh man, oh man. I'm not, I'm having some trouble guys. Can you like help me out? Just go over it again. And then when you color it in, it should be fine. See, see, there's nothing to worry about. I promise, I, I sincerely tell you, it might seem like it's going bad. It might seem like nothing matters in your entire life anymore, but just persevere. Look, Rowlet's already done, we're good. Now we're gonna need to close off Popolio here by going over him just one more time and coloring it in. See? Boom, 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 boom. Oh my shit. Nope. Fuck. Uh, color over. And onto the collar. And straight up to the nose. Oh no. That was bad. Straight up to the nose. Boom. Where's the pink? There's pink. Pink. What is left? Got this. Oh shit. Shit nuggets. Um, I'm just not even gonna waste my time trying to fill this. I'm just gonna color it in. See, you could like, you could improvise. It's fine. Improvising's cool. Nobody's gonna notice. Technique. It's how you get things done quickly. You improv a little if something goes wrong. Now, Litten, look at Litten. He's not even that bad. He's like almost pure white. Or well, not pure white, pure black shit. Fuck, I'm losing mind of my colors. But yeah, he's pretty much pure black and some red. So there's not that much you need to like think about when you're coloring him in. Just fill in what you need to fill in. Okay, so this is a little tricky. This is a little bit tricky, but only a little. You don't need to pay too much mind to it, but stripes. I didn't really teach you guys about stripes yet, but he, yeah, he has some stripes. But it's totally fine, because look at this. Oh shit, no, I guess I fucked it up. Oh my Jesus, fucking Linton, man. You're killing me here, dude. 
trying to make a some decent quality ass content here and you're just fuck you Litton. not picking you not even picking you you little shit snake. this bitch is not my starter boom 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 oh no all right so the stripes are done we're pretty much we're almost on our way to victory we're on our road to victory oh man they're just not letting up they're showing us all the challenges they possibly can but you know what it's to it's okay it's completely okay because that just lets it lets me teach you there's some teacher student opportunities here that you can't really get in a normal classroom so look now he's cooperating a little he's calmed down our little friend knows what his fate is so he's just giving in when you know what your fate is you give in all right you don't fight like a little retard you just give in okay now there's his little smile see he's smiling he's happy he knows what he's gotten himself into and he's happy about it all right so now that this part is um you know finished up look you notice something that their picture has that we don't of course our picture's better but we're missing something we're missing something important and no i'm not talking about Papilio's little feet lines sorry i forgot those but no i mean a background you see that a background so we're just gonna mimic the background they have they have like red on one side and like a, i want to say a purplish color on the other side and it kind of lights up in the middle so here we go so you just do that right there boom not that hard color oh shit I, I'm not, what do i do what do i do? where where even is the break oh are you the break you're a break no i don't know i'm gonna show you guys one of the one of the tools I like to use see there's a shape tool so I could just draw a straight line down and boom colored in and then over here I could draw another straight line down boom oh what the hell this line tool is just not cooperating I guess you see that see that that's called discommunication and dysfunctionality I have both of those but next on the agenda is lighting it up a little. So you got this little light in the middle and boom. See that? That's how you draw. Here's your first drawing tutorial of Pokemon Gen 7 starters. I'm Kaz and this has been an episode of Caster Pieces. Thank you guys. I'm still typing this so hold on. I'm not gonna, that was my outro but I'm not done. So just like, you know, I can't talk when I'm typing. All right, Pokemon Gen 7 starters by Kaz. Thank you for watching Chill Zone. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out my channel if you even care. You probably don't. So just sub to this one. This is totally cool. I'll forgive you.